Hi, it's Dusty Blonde. I'm going to be taking apart a microwave today. As you can see, I have all my tools laid out on the table. You might be asking yourself why I have Snobby's chopper in my hand on the table. You will find out later on in the video why I've got that. Right, I'm going to start off with cutting the plug off. Then I'm going to use the wire cutters First job, done right. I've taken many of these apart They're roughly all the same and obviously I've got to get this done rather quick so it don't give you much time It's a nice hot day today out right here. It's meant to be 26 degrees in England. Get 
go. Guess what you have inside a microwave. Right, that is your transformer. That is your capacitor. And that is your magnetron, which is, it is magnetic somewhere. Right. Um, getting a bit messier. why people cut this off here and end up with a bit of wire cold cable whatever all you have to do is get these tools snobby's tools cut that there bend that over and voila you have that instead of that so there. Um, I'm going to turn this upside down now. Hopefully. I don't use a drill because they're too big. If anyone out there knows of a woman friendly drill, a little one to go in their hands. If not, invent one. Put it on there for a moment. That is your magnetron. Magnetic. Fan. I think that's copper. I have to get snobby to check that out. Motor. everywhere I am meant to down in the pot but um, I'm rushing
side. Now, time for the motor. And that I use at the end to put all the scrap metal in. I use Snobby's chopper so the rain don't collect in it, hence why there's holes in the bottom of it. The last thing is the capacitor. microwave hope, hope you like it watch for the next one thanks for watching thanks for watching please subscribe please subscribe or like or thumbs up bye